Hey everybody, my name is Alex Williams. I'm a chemistry major here at Center College, and today I'm going to be teaching you how to use Center's ChemServe website in order to integrate your NMR spectra. First, all you need to do is click on the magnet, which will take you to a list of recently taken spectra, and all you need to do is click on the file name that you gave to your spectrum in Young Hall. This will bring up an interface in which you can integrate the signals within your spectrum. But before you do this, what you may need to do is remove any common solvents or impurities found within your spectrum. By entering the URL found on the screen, a solvent list will pop up containing all the common solvents found within NMR spectra. Here you can see we have a signal exactly where deuterated chloroform appears. By clicking the apply button in the menu, the signals within the spectrum will automatically be integrated and the signal matching chloroforms can then be removed. After the common solvents have been removed from the signal list, it is important to then select the signals pertinent to your experiment. This can be done by clicking and dragging your mouse within the spectrum viewer. After this, the signals need to be normalized. This can be done by clicking on the lowest signal and then pressing the normalize button within the menu. You can then set your normalization value and each of the signal values will be adjusted. Once you are done editing your spectrum, it can then be exported by right clicking within the spectrum window and selecting the export option you wish to use. PDF and PNG formats are available along with others that will let you view the spectra within certain programs made for editing spectra. That's it for this tutorial. I hope this video has helped you learn how to use the ChemServe website, and I hope it will help you with your upcoming experiments.